Hi there. This is the second episode of Planning for Pregnancy. Now, in this episode, I'll give you very important medical tips of about how to prevent damaging your baby unknowingly, particularly in the first part of your pregnancy. Now, go back to the first part, part one of the planning for pregnancy, where I have discussed about when the egg is being released, ovulation happens, and how long it lives, and when fertilization takes place. Now, normally, the egg is released around 14 days after your last period, the LMP. And because it only allows the fertilization on that day, because it has a lifespan of only 24 hours, actually, your baby is formed on that very day. That is in the middle of the cycle. And when you know that you're pregnant, when you miss the period, which is about three weeks later, you miss the period, you do the test and you find out that you are pregnant, which you didn't know for the last three weeks. So my first important suggestion or the advice is that when you are planning for pregnancy, when you need to go to a doctor, especially for the second half of your cycle, tell him or her that you are planning for pregnancy. Otherwise, unknowingly, you may take some harmful medicines, may undergo some harmful tests like x-rays, etc. The first trimester, the first 12 weeks of pregnancy is very, very critical for the baby as far as these development of different structures are concerned. Now, particularly important the period of embryogenesis, that is four to eight weeks. Now, unfortunately, I have given birth to babies without hands, fingers, and like these things. Now, the development of hands and fingers usually takes around seventh week of pregnancy. So any harmful influence at that time of the pregnancy can't affect the growth of the hands, growth of the fingers, etc. So be careful about what you take as food, as medicines, what investigations you undergo during the first eight to 12 weeks of pregnancies to prevent any harmful damage to the baby. As far as the food is concerned, better avoid any sort of outside food. Now, these outside food may have certain bugs, may have certain uncooked things inside it, which can damage the embryo. Similarly, better avoid handling animals. They have certain parasites. Now, cat feces is very, very harmful to the baby. Don't immerse yourself in water like in the bathtub if swimming pool like a woman's body is open to outside this if the the water is contaminated it will enter very close to your uterus so be careful during these first 12 weeks about what you ingest what you're exposed to now there's a very interesting study in uh, england where they have said that even dios and perfumes can theoretically damage the baby. I have seen mothers who have not worn any lipstick during their entire pregnancy. Now, the English girls have revolted. They say, do you want us to become barbaric? That may be too much. You can just balance what you're taking. But for example, dyeing of hair, using very, very strong chemicals during the pregnancy, especially, especially, again, I stress, in the first half of pregnancy, the first trimester of pregnancy, the first 12 weeks of pregnancy, you should avoid. Thank you. Next episode, I'll tell you what is the usefulness of folic acid in this early pregnancy. Bye-bye.